What's up guys, it's CGT. There's not much time before the sun sets and I'm barely using this light. So something I really want to get out and I have like 15 minutes because I'm not using my SD card because I lost my GoPro, which I'm probably going to find in my room. But if you were looking on DJI today, you would have noticed, well I actually looked at this during class because it popped up as an announcement, but DJI just released the new Phantom 4 Pro. Phantom Pro it's sort of like the Phantom Pro, Phantom 3 Pro, but better in a sense that they did everything customers wanted. They added the optical um, on every side except top, which is kind of odd because they did not forget that on the Inspire 1, but I'll get into that later. So, sorry, Inspire 2. But yeah, the drone looks really cool. I mean, it's pretty much the same drone if you're looking at 4K, but you do get better quality. You definitely are going to have a better time on Follow Me uh, and less worries because a lot of people's complaints were, yeah, you have optical avoidance, but still going backwards. So they added all of that. You know, the Follow Me is way better. The camera is now a one inch sensor, which is kind of funny how big it is for a drone because in truth, it's like so far away from a full frame, but it's still a really good sensor. The fact that it is doing the 4K quality that it can do at the sharpness and stuff. I love it, but I need I don't know why I'm rushing, but yeah. So like that drone looks pretty epic, but for the price, I think you'd be better off getting the Inspire 2. Now the Inspire 2. It's like the Inspire 1 but 1 billion times better. The Inspire 1 only had the articulate and the double two people can operate at the one time. That's the only thing it had over the Phantom 3 and the Phantom 4. The Phantom not the Phantom. The Inspire 2 now has optical avoidance and FPV camera. Because I never flew an Inspire 1. You know, I've just flown a Phantom 2. And I was just, like, thinking, how? what's the point of one person flying and one person, like, steering the camera if you want to get a side shot but you can't look forward? So, like, now there's an FPV camera for that that is articulate and is stabilized for some reason. And then you have the two front, the other two cameras on the front, which are optical, which are way better than the Phantoms because they can reach up to 200 meters. Yes, I actually have that fact correct. And then they have the ones on top so that way you can fly below stuff. The reason why they didn't add ones on the side and stuff is because with the Phantom, say you want to get a backwards panning shot. To get that shot, you have to fly the Phantom backwards because the camera can only face one direction. With the Inspire one, well, A, you wouldn't really think someone would use that, but even if they did, you turn the drone around and then you fly it backwards since the camera is articulate up to 360 degrees because it wouldn't make sense to add sensors where it's not needed. Like the top sensors I get, the reason why they probably didn't do it on the Phantom 4 is probably to cut costs, especially with all the other sensors they added. But, like, I'm super psyched. I know this video is short, but, like, I just really need to get it out there because no one has a video on the Phantom Pros yet except DJI, and I watch them, and it's really epic. So, if you can, without a doubt, get these over the uh, current ones. But, like, it depends. Because, say you don't have it, I would recommend the Inspire 1, mainly because the Inspire 2 doesn't have too many features. And if you're worried about the camera and stuff, there is a Inspire 1 pro edition which comes with all the raw camera and stuff and i think you can change out the lens but yeah i mean if you can just check those drones out even if you can't buy them just look at them it's like the map the mavic took over the phantom 4's place now the phantom 4 is dominant again with the phantom 4 pro so that's all i hope you guys check out these products hopefully i'll have an actual vlog soon but yeah peace